six months ago, if you asked me who would ruin Madden Ultimate Team, I'm not sure what I would have guessed. Maybe a super fast Lamar Jackson that you just can't bring down. Or maybe a 99 overall Patrick Mahomes that makes any throw in the world. Or even a classic Derrick Henry at quarterback. Great guesses, but they're all wrong. The player that ruined Madden 24 Ultimate Team is George Karlaftis. Now I get it, I'm a YouTuber. I sensationalize titles and every player's overpowered every player is broken, but I really need you to hear me out on this one. Now, on paper, Super Bowl Limited, George Karlaftis is really, really good, but he shouldn't ruin the game. To explain why he's so overpowered, I want to remind you about Madden 20 Ultimate Team. Madden 20 was the first Madden to ever introduce X-Factor abilities, and in that game, there was an Eric Dickerson. Now, Eric Dickerson had a unique X-Factor ability. Eric Dickerson's X-Factor would start the game activated, and it would never turn off. Off. Meaning no matter what you did, no matter how many times you tried to tackle him, he would keep breaking tackles, dominating the field, and doing the most ridiculous shit you've ever seen. Also, a huge thank you to SeatGeek for sponsoring today's video. SeatGeek is the best place to get tickets for anything. And I know the NFL season's over, but there are a ton of NBA games I want to attend, and I'll definitely be getting my tickets on SeatGeek. And with SeatGeek's pricing indicators, you always know you're getting the best deal. Green is good, and red is bad. So look for that when you're buying your next ticket. Also, of course, I can get you a discount. First, you gotta download SeatGeek with the link in the top of the description. Then use my code MMG for $20 off your first purchase. Once again, that's $20 off your first order on SeatGeek. Just use the promo code MMG and click the link in the top of the description. Peace. Now, since Madden 20, EA basically said, yeah, that was messed up. We're gonna tone it down. We're not gonna do that again. And for Madden 21, Madden 22, Madden 23, we were safe, sort of. Until George Karlaftis and a brand new ability that didn't even exist in Madden 20 called Colossus. This ability is Colossus Light It Up. Dominant pass rush, even versus double teams. Now, generally speaking, if you ran Unstoppable Force, you would get slightly better pass rush if you activated the ability. Now, to activate Unstoppable Force, you first needed to sack the quarterback twice. So after you've gotten two sacks, now you have the X Factor and you get to the quarterback a little bit faster. That's not how Colossus works. Colossus makes you utterly buttfuck the offensive lineman in front of you, regardless if they send two, and guess what you gotta do to activate it? Nothing! Absolutely nothing! You need to boot up the game. I am not kidding. It cannot be turned off. If you're wondering why that is, he is a Super Bowl player. Super Bowl players, once you unlock the Super Bowl token, you can unlock it on the field pass, and I added it here to George Karlaftis, get their Super Bowl Light It Up X Factors. I know it's a little confusing, but Light It Up X Factors, as you can see right on the screen, stay active all game. Now, I learned the hard way about George Karlaftis. I'm sure you guys might have watched my Mahomes video, and he was such an impactful player that I had to get him myself, and I had to show you guys that it's over. Until they nerf this, which I don't think they will, you're gonna see this on every every single team. Now, if that wasn't enough, he also gets El Toro for free, which literally I don't even think matters because he's going to dominate Bull Rush anyway. He also gets Demoralizer just in case you thought maybe you could activate your halfback and break a tackle. No, he gets Demoralizer, so his hit sticks wipe the zone progress. And I gave him Defensive Rally just to be a dick. There is no reason to use this ability. It adds a pass rush point to all linemen on third and fourth down. I also gave that same ability to Chase Young so that they're adding pass rush points to each other on third and fourth down. So overall, this whole team is a pretty solid team. We're at 93 overall. It's nothing crazy, but it's not bad either. Um, the only thing that matters here is George Karlaftis. But as you'll see here, I do have Karlaftis as my rush defensive tackle. So sometimes he'll be a true edge rusher and sometimes he'll be a rush D tackle. I think he's a little bit better D tackle, but at the end of the day, I don't think it really matters. It's the stupidest card you've ever seen. I've done enough talking. Let's go hop into a game so I can show you how stupid this is. Derek Barnes, Ray Lewis, Doug Williams. Yeah, my top three is disgusting regardless, but... For me to do an entire game based on defense, the guy's got to be that good. I'll try and keep my offensive possessions uh, quick. I'm either going to turn the ball over or catch that shit. Look at this little route combo we've got. You ever seen this one? I call this the Eiffel Tower because you get fucked from both sides. Okay, MVS down the middle. We got the post and the corner. And I got almost sacked, but I'm going to go with the Eiffel Tower again. When you run the Eiffel Tower on your friends, make sure you say MMG showed you how to do the Eiffel Tower. It also works best if you have uh, two guys and one girl. All right. Look at Debo. Look at B.O. <laughs> guys, it's a George Karlaftis video. It doesn't matter. 
Gonna be honest, I don't think the defensive formation matters that much. So in this particular formation, Karlaftis is... So right here, he's an edge. <laughs> hey, he got his pass off. He made a nice play, but he instantly broke his tackle. All right, let's try this. So this is where Karlaftis should be double teamed. And let's see how he does against it. He actually got around it. Respect. Especially, dude, if we could get one of these linemen to commit to... I'm going to go 4-3 over so we get four down linemen. See how this looks. Checks low. Gets six. Ooh, nice play. First and goal. Let's see what he goes for here on first and goal. A little stretch run. Bruh. Not the best start, but... I believe in Karlaftis. I will be going back to chucking haymakers. Nice catch, Pacheco. This might be a touchdown for Hester. Is that a good ball? Are you out of your fucking mind? It was a touchdown. It just happened. I will not call that his greatest uh, play of all time. Get gooder. Threw right at your face. You gotta lurk that. Sometimes it is that simple. Look at Dalton Schultz. We gotta get down there. I need George Karlaftis on the field if I wanna win. Maybe I put him in on offense. Debo! Beauty. Beauty. Keep running it. Keep running it. Pacheco. Ah, that works. Get my homes. Got him. Beautiful throw. That was knocked out. What? Oh, that's unlucky. Damn, some pretty unlucky drops here. All right, Karlaftis. Let's do your thing, buddy. It's going to go back to the I-form run. Could probably just switch sides on it. Yep. It's actually an RPO. Nice tag. Okay, he likes the low passes. Nice find. First and ten. Get these off fast. <laughs> All right, Carlap just got home for the first time. A slow first quarter, but I believe in his ability to wreak unbelievable havoc here. That did not open. Oh my god. God, nice ball. Good freeform. The diving catch on the freeform, too. Okay, so he ran like an RPO bubble out of this last time. Just gonna run it. Nothing there. Second. I actually don't know what this is. RPO of some variety. Absolutely bottled. Great defense. Her Nate. Oh, I wish. I wish you got that off. Damn, that was picked. Hey, that's a good stop right there. Karlaft has finally started getting home. Honestly, the meta might literally just to be rush two players, drop everyone else into coverage, and Karlaft still beats his double team. I got to give credit to my opponent, though. He's getting the ball off really fast. Oh, that was fucking disgusting. Inside the user, juke the CPU. Uh, let's just get this snap off. I like that route right there. Just don't fumble, Pacheco. Great play out of Pacheco. Two-minute warning. Red zone again. I just got to take care of the ball. This could definitely be a Debo touchdown. In fact, this is a Debo touchdown. I just need a little bit of time in the pocket. There it is. It's a bad free form. It's way too aggressive of a free form. Oh, he's dropped into coverage. Beauty. Debo Samuel. Hey, got the first down. Could definitely do some clock shenanigans here, but don't have to. Just going to take maybe two yards on that. Let's go no huddle. Actually got three out of that. Nice work. Oh, I thought for sure I could get that with Mahomes. Got two yards on it. Slowly but surely getting a little bit closer. I think Dalton Schultz is here. He is. Money. Let go. All right, we're on the board. Let's go, Karlaf. This is your turn now, buddy. Although, I'm going to go for two. Literally exact same play. Oh, he sees it this time. 
Oh, you're there. Beauty! Mahomes looking clutch on that drive. 8-10. All right, I'm going to try nickel 3-3 three, three and just let Karlaftis beat his double team. Well, this kind of looks like a run play. It sure is. His bot, though. Great defense. All right. That was very generous. It was a generous five yards on that, but all right. Throw that. I fucking dare you. Karlaftis! Hey! All right, dude, that might be the move. Just let him cook his double team. It's hard to say if that's actually the move here. All right, let's pinch this. Guess pass. I'm on the corner out. Oh, nice ball. Definitely needed my boy to get home there. It's gonna go a short, a dig. You just got fucking lurked, buddy. Ooh! 13 seconds left, three timeouts. I can take the lead here. Honestly, my opponent is perfectly countering this. He's throwing the ball so fast, but that's actually a pretty good example right there of why this is so good. He has literally no choice but to throw the ball in the first two seconds or he gets sacked. And right there, he throws it in the first two seconds to a throw that he should not have thrown. Now there's Scantling, Beauty, five seconds. I got one more throw like that and I got to get in range. I just got to get down. Got to get down, got to get the timeout off. Got him. Get down. Fuck. Got it off. I could have maybe gone to the end zone, but it wasn't worth risking it. Hey, what a drive. Yo, we really came back right there. Down 10-0. Things were not looking good. Make it 11-0. Take the lead right before half. Nice work. And I think I start on defense, which is perfect. Nice ball. Ooh, barely got two down. <laughs> Hey, he's in there on the run, too. I take it, Karlaftis. Second and 11. There he is! Karlaftis! Hey, I promised you boys two sacks. Just got his second, and there's nine minutes left. I want to get up to four. Would make me happy. Oh, he got me with this last time. He got me with the deep dig. I got to go fake like I'm going... Nope. <laughs> the dude, Karlaftis, right in his fucking... Karlaftis actually sacked him! Dude, I'm telling you, half of the reason it's so good is it makes people play like shit. All right, I gotta look for Debo here. I know it's gonna be open. Ah, he knew. Good play by him. Honestly, I think I might be able to get Pacheco here. Yup. What a juke and another! <laughs> Come on. Um, I'm gonna go with Debo whip route. Don't think he's really seen that today. Yeah, he hasn't. Beautiful. If I get the touchdown in the two-point, he's in a lot of trouble. I'm going to give a Dalton Schultz whip route. Vacates the middle. Ah! He's staying up. Pacheco's a dog right now. We have really come back from a very rough start to this game. We have just really brought it back here. Had a touchdown in the back right of the end zone. And I just got an intentional grounding. That's actually so bad. All right, I just need a big pickup here. I wonder if Dalton Schultz corner route is there. He thinks I'm going Debo corner route, but Debo post might be there. Yup. Yup. Oh, what a... Oh, I got to go for this. Fuck it. I don't need four points. Come on. I'm going for it. This is huge. Fourth and five. Debo. Did no. What? How could I not? I snapped it and then threw it. How could it possibly have gotten to me that fast? He sent four against five. That's such a... Hey, we still got the one-point lead, bro, but I would love that playback. That's... There's Karlaftis on the ground, too. Nice work. Second and eight. Come on. Oh, he's got that throw if he wants it. Nice work. Yep, got to play the... Got to play the juke. Went for the strip. Didn't get it. Needed my boy Karlafty there. Probably want something underneath. Something short. <sighs> Karlaftis in his face still made the throw. Nice work. He was right there. First and 10. I'm going to switch the pressure up. Ooh, a little intentional grounding of his own. And that wasn't Karlaftis. I think it was Warren Sapp. Second and 24. Nice defense. Switched it up with a blitz that time! Third and 24! He hasn't seen a lot of blitzes. That was definitely new for him. We know it's a pass. Nice play. But an even better tackle, and he might have... Yeah, he actually lost yards because that animation. That's a bummer. Fourth and 12. Badgley's gonna drill it, make this game 13 to 11. Need an awesome Mahomes drive here, and then um some amazing defense. I only gotta get in field goal range. About the Dalton Schultz corner out. 
No. Dude, what is this nano that he's getting? Is this like some glitch blitz I don't know about? He's sending four against five and he's always getting home. I guess, I mean, I'm using George Karlaftis. Not sure I'm allowed to talk. I spent my mommy's hard-earned money on that. This might be a dot. Dude, twice? What the fuck? Dude, he's not even reaching for it. It's right on you. Oh my goodness. I'm getting hosed right now. This is whack. What a bummer. All right, third and 10. He left the seam. We're going to pick it up anyway. It's a legacy drive. Feds can't get me with some, some silly stuff right now. Dalton Schultz. The feds very well could have gotten me with some silly stuff right there. That was, um, that's what you call a ball that should have been intercepted. That's what you call that. I think Pacheco actually could just take this shit yard right here. Let's see if I get any time in the pocket. Oh my God, look at Debo. That was, you know what's funny about that? That was such a horrible ball that it was a good ball. So the Lord giveth and the Lord taketh away, I suppose. Let's go first and 10. Ooh, he's gonna get <laughs> He's mad now. Now he's really mad. That should have been a fumble. All right, we're even. I don't got a thing to say now. Oh, look at Pacheco. Touchdown. Gorgeous playmaker and a really good throw from Mahomes. Yeah, I got bailed on that drive too. 18 to 13. George Karlaftis, take me home. So he gets a touchdown here and gets the PAT. He has 20. He gets a touchdown, goes for two. He has 21. Doesn't get it. He has 19. So needs the touchdown, but no matter what, a field goal can either send me to overtime or win the ball game. So I like how that sounds. Keep him out of the end zone. We win the game. I'm trying to remember what he's been doing out of this. Wow. That was just such a good throw. I didn't get any pressure from my boy there. Oh, Ronnie. Oh, that was right in front of Ronnie Lott. I needed that right there. Damn. That's okay. I'm going to switch to nickel 3-3. Three, three. I'm going to let George Karlaftis just work on the double team. I might just drop five into coverage. He's my only pass rush, man. Is that so fucked up or what? He wants this dig. <gasps> he got home against five. He got home against five. That's messed up. Nah, that's so messed up. Yeah, I'm telling you, man, this game's over. This shit is just stupid beyond repair. He just sacked him against five. Oh my God. Dude, this is so fucked. Is he going to run this ball? Does he think I'm guessing pass? He can't run the ball. Nice play. Honestly, sick play call. You can't do that against Lurk Artist. That's a nasty play call, though. The deep sit down was nasty, but we almost just iced up the game. All right, first and 10. Just got to play smart and um, take this puppy home. Um, No reason to throw this, but I'd like the clock to chew. See, I was worried about fumbling, so I got on the edge. But now the clock is not ticking. I need to get a first down. Oof. Jesus, that knockout was crazy. Third and nine, all of a sudden, my offense is in a really big conversion here to keep this drive alive. Got him. Diabolical whip route from Debo. He's got the first down. He shaded inside. So this is huge, too, because a field goal puts me up eight. And I am in field goal range. So at this point, we're kind of just handing this ball off for the W. It's not quite a W because he can call the timeout here. I could throw the bubble on this RPO. Let's see if Debo is open on the bubble here. He actually is, but so is the run. I have to run here. First down, game, ball game. No, I want to watch it. I want to watch you block five. Oh my God, here we go. Hey, GG's my opponent. He played a great game. Can't make this shit up, dude. That is so insane. Like the best defensive play for me to run is drop 10 into coverage and put George Karlaftis in the dead center of five NFL offensive linemen and have him sack him twice. They're back to back. Ladies and gentlemen, you are looking at the end of Madden Ultimate Team. I hope you enjoyed. Peace.